So if you just picked up your brand new RV, you likely may have this brand new Furion 12 volt refrigerator. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to operate it. So the first thing we need to do is turn it on. Come follow me and I'll show you how. So you'll see on the front of the refrigerator, you have three different buttons here. There's fridge, freezer, and function. If I tap any of the buttons here, you're gonna see that there's two lines above fridge and freezer. That means the refrigerator and freezer are currently off. So we need to turn it on, and how we do so is we're gonna click and hold the function button. We're gonna do so for probably a good 10 seconds or so. So now that the refrigerator is turned on, we can see so by having temperatures above freezer and above fridge. In order for us to change any settings on this refrigerator, the first thing we need to do is unlock it. So we need to click and hold this unlock button here. Now that it's unlocked, it'll give us the ability to change the temperatures. Now for normal use on this fridge slash freezer, we're gonna set our temperatures to the following. For the freezer, we're gonna set it to zero. And for the refrigerator, we're gonna set it to 41 degrees. So for those of you that plan to use this at uh, campgrounds or be plugged into shore power, you're gonna primarily just set it in this position and forget it. Now, I'm gonna show you how to turn the refrigerator back off. So all we'll simply do is just click and hold the function button. Now there's no more temperatures up and above freezer and fridge. That means your refrigerator is now shut off. Be sure to keep your refrigerator doors propped nice and open. That way you don't grow any mold or mildew after your long weekend of having fun. Now for those of you that wanna stick around and see the different functions that this fridge and freezer has to offer, we're gonna show you those next. In order for us to put it in the first mode, we're gonna click this function button. So you'll see an icon illuminates and it looks like an umbrella with a sunshine. This is your off grid slash vacation mode. This will conserve the most amount of power possible. So for those of you that plan to boondock or want to preserve all the battery power that this is using, you're gonna to wanna to put it in this mode here. You wanna ensure that you limit the amount of times that you're opening uh, the refrigerator doors. That way it can just maintain the temperature inside and not pull very much power. So the next function is super freezer mode. When placed into this mode, you're gonna see a little snowflake pops up with a square around it. And it's gonna change the freezer temperature to negative 10 degrees and the fridge up to 41 degrees. It's exactly what it sounds like. It's going to kick the compressor to the freezer in high gear. That way you can freeze your foods faster. It puts it in this mode for roughly 24 hours or if the freezer reaches uh, negative 18 degrees, then it'll shut off and kick it back into the normal use. Next is the super fridge mode. You're gonna have a snowflake here with a teardrop around it. Your freezer is at zero degrees and the fridge is at 32 degrees. In this mode, it's going to reach the refrigerator temperature in the quickest way possible. It'll stay in this mode for 150 minutes. Typically, any of these refrigerators when running off of shore power will only take just a couple hours for them to properly cool down. So this is a great way for a last minute trip for you to throw your stuff inside the fridge and get it cooled down as quickly as possible. Now for some of you that want the best of both worlds, we can put it both in super fridge and super freezer mode. You'll notice you have both icons illuminated here, the temperature's at the appropriate uh, you know, set temp. Now we can cool down the fridge and the freezer as fast as possible. So I hope this video helped you get some confidence in your brand new 12 volt Furion refrigerator. If you have any other questions, be sure to leave them in the comments down below. My name is Justin, and again, I work at Beckley's RVs here in Thermont, Maryland. Look forward to hearing from you guys, and we'll see you on the next one.